friends welcome back to the pragmatic lopa when you want to have a balanced healthy and nutritious superfood breakfast in a jiffy meal prep is an easy and the best option in today's recipe almost everything used for making quinoa poha can be prepared in advance as part of meal prep so that when you want to have it as breakfast with not much time to spare in its making meal prep can be a boon to make it an absolute cake walk in previous videos you can see how you can cook quinoa store in an airtight container for future use as and when required similarly you can roast peanuts in advance and store as well for details you can check out the above links but just for today's video sake I'll again show you how you can cook it. For one bowl full of quinoa poha, take one fourth cup of raw quinoa and thoroughly wash by rubbing through running water to remove phytic acid and natural plant residue that coat these seeds called saponins, which would otherwise contribute to the bitterness of the food prepared. You can check out other important detailed health benefits of quinoa and even soaking by clicking the up top i button heat pan add half cup of water let it boil once it starts boiling add the washed and rinsed quinoa cover with a lid and let it simmer for 15 minutes in the meanwhile let's get done with other preparations take one small potato wash peel and dice into small cubes At present I did not have a small one so using this big potato just to show you guys anyways I won't be using the entire stuff in today's making I always use this kind of waste paper sheet while peeling which makes the after cleanup process hassle free I prefer to wash them thoroughly after cutting so excess starch can be removed then cook it either boil on stove or like me cook in microwave for 5 minutes If you have ready to use roasted peanuts, keep aside 2 tablespoon and use other 2 tablespoon of roasted and peeled peanuts to crush them using mortar and pestle. And in case you do not have, instantly roast peanuts for 4 to 5 minutes and let it cool down before crushing the same way. Now let's get back to quinoa. As now 15 minutes is up, switch off the flame but do not lift the lid. Let it be covered for 5 more minutes so it becomes soft and fluffy. Now remove excess water. You can see the potato is cooked and even quinoa is cooked to perfect. Soft and fluffy. Now with all the major preparations done, let's start. Heat a skillet. Once heated up, use 1 teaspoon of any preferred choice of oil. I use sesame oil. Add half teaspoon mustard seeds on splattering. Add half teaspoon cumin seeds. Once it starts to splatter, add eight to nine curry leaves, half onion chopped. On becoming soft and translucent, add one four teaspoon turmeric powder and one green chili chopped. Add half cup boiled potatoes, three tablespoon green peas, two tablespoon roasted peanuts. All this while keep mixing them well. Now add cooked quinoa. Mix well and add salt to taste and cook for more 2 to 3 minutes. 2 tablespoon of crushed peanuts on switching off the flame. Pour half a lemon juice and garnish with 2 tablespoon of fresh chopped coriander leaves and serve hot. Hope you try out this nutritious and super quick breakfast. or have it as evening snack very soon as always like share and sub if you haven't already do check out other healthy snacking recipes on my channel eat healthy and stay happy